Welcome to my channel, my name is Tracy Parker and today we're going to be talking about three mistakes I see beginner photographers make and even some professionals. Let's learn. Number one, details. Yes, I said details. It's not always about how you click that shutter button that matters. If you can catch little details that a normal person doesn't think about, you can make a huge impact on your clients and their photos. Here are some of the details you should be looking for. Hair ties. This is one of the first things I ask my customers all the time when they show up. Do you have some hair ties on? If they do, just simply have them remove those. It will save you a ton of time in editing and look so much better. Another super common item these days are cell phones. These are almost impossible to edit out, so make sure they take those out of the pockets. Other things to look for are keychains. Also make sure jewelry items are facing the right direction like necklaces and rings. Basically scan your clients as best as you can and try to catch as many little details as you can. They will love you for it and you'll love yourself even more when you don't have to edit those things out. Number two, check your backgrounds. When choosing your backgrounds, make sure you look around it quickly to see what might be in it that will look bad for your clients to be in front of or have growing out of their heads. Things like garbage cans, dumpsters, light poles, trees, bright signs, cars, and any other objects that take away from the subject of your photo. Look for less busy backgrounds that enhance the subject or just blend into the background. It's all about making your subject stand out to be the viewer's only focus. Number three, locations. Once you get those backgrounds clean of clutter, think about what you will do with it. Don't just stand your client there and take a hundred photos of them making different faces and looking left or right. Make sure you take a variety of photos from different angles and different croppings of them. Also try to find a location that has a few different backgrounds to choose from. The more looks you can give to the client in the end will help you get repeat business and set you apart from the cookie cutter types. If you found these tips helpful, make sure you share this video with your friends and also hit that like button and subscribe. I'll be posting new videos each week, so make sure you keep checking back. Until then, make sure you dream big, inspire others, and live. Oh, and one other little thing. Make sure in the comments below to list things that you've missed and everything like this. Tell me some horror stories or anything like that. I'll be looking for the comments. Thank you.